property line ends right at the road down there? So uh, no, because the sidewalk, um, sidewalk is a public... I can see how that... Uh, yeah, if it's a public right sidewalk... Here, uh, they were telling me you had your camera facing the actual restaurant with yeah. your sign, so... Um, do you agree with the law or you don't agree with the law? So, yeah, I can't I agree with freedom of speech. Freedom of speech? All right, I hear what you're saying. That's awesome. Got to support it. Okay. Yeah, I agree with freedom of speech. They should be able to say whatever, as long as it's not on private property. Yeah, I'm just yeah, trying to figure out where the property line is. Yeah, the because property line, it goes from like the Because the road, because there's a public sidewalk, which is the public easement to go through. So that's where... Yeah, the property like here, line for... Like this is this public. Property, I can see how uh, that's private because that's part of the restaurant. Right. Uh, but um, this has got to be public. This whole... Because this is, like this this is part of the railroad. Line. This is part uh, of the railroad station. Uh, this is still part of the property line though. Um, if it Are wasn't, you? I'd be like, hell, stay right here and do what you want. But, um, so there's got so if people so, are like, I can see how that's a private shopping area. I can see that. Um, right, the whole Pornhub thing. I don't, you don't support, support that, that. The existence but, of Pornhub. Okay. Yes. Okay, I understand. But the law, definitely, I support the law, obviously. But as far as like the whole Pornhub thing and needing ID to access it, do you think you so you support that law or you don't or are you unsure? Um, I'm kind of unsure on that. Okay. Um, okay. I mean. I'm a single guy. Yes, I'm. I'm not denying that. That stuff is there. It, it's there, obviously, but I'm not gonna go around and be like, "Oh, this person should do this, and this person would make a good." What? No, I'm not. No, I'm not that kind of person. But I mean, as far as as far as the property management goes, as far as people like standing on the property line with. Assigning cameras, well, no, they I'm don't allow that. Yeah, I mean, if that's... I'm on the property, yeah, I, I definitely don't want to. I know that's a, that if they say I have to get off, I have to get off. But I was just trying right. to figure out where I think it feels like a public sidewalk, but it kind of weaves through. Do you agree with the law or not? Uh, that you need an ID to access Pornhub? Do you think that should be allowed? Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's not an invasion of privacy? Uh, no. Okay. I feel like no because at the end of the day, there's so much that go on that goes on behind doors that we don't see okay. when we look at porn up. Okay. We don't we don't know if it's trafficking, sex trafficking of kids that then they can de-age them or make them look older. So it's there's those things too that we do gotta think about when they do those type of things or we watch those type of things. We don't do that because because of I guess just it's like a sex driven era. Mm -hmm. Uh even though it's, it was way sexual still back then, baby baby boomer. Season, yeah, but now it's like worse. Yeah, it's like it's worse, and then it just opened way more doors to to just more fantasies out there that you gotta you gotta keep in. So and you just support the you don't like the existence of Pornhub at all. That's what your whole thing is. Like, I will say this: it causes strange and crazy addictions that you would never even okay think of. I see. Uh, because you're in, you're in it. When you're in it, you don't think that you're addicted. Okay. But you're addicted. Because you want, you don't want to do it again when you, when you don't have a spouse, or even if you do have a spouse. There's a lot of people that are in relationships that actually have spouses, female or male spouses, or whatever sex gender spouses, and they're doing it behind their backs, or you know, doing a little bit deeper stuff, or they go deeper into doing video calls after that, or you know, just it goes it can get deeper than than what. They're it, just watching it. Yeah. Okay. So. so. So since you don't support the whole existence of it, you're okay with this ID law and, and the block? I mean, I would say anybody can do what they want to do. Mm -hmm. That's them, that's their choice, that's their body. But it, things do, it. in life things will, it will come back around. I okay. thought what goes around comes around, so. Okay. You never know, your child may, may, may do it. And then it's like, dang, you know, I watched, I watched porn, I was addicted to it, now my child is over here doing it. And okay. So. It's a good answer. Right. Thank you. Appreciate it. Take care. Good. Yeah, so this is, I think. Because I have a different name and I don't even feel comfortable using my own ID. So even little things like that could be triggering. I completely understand that. And maybe it's not something they should be focusing on. They should be focusing on Palestine. They should be focusing so. on everything else yeah. but this. But this. But also, I think maybe this is just a, a way of saying hey this is the porn industry and there needs to be a little bit more regulation just like you were saying with like non-consent like 
that happens to so many people mm -hmm. and they don't even know that it's on there. So it's like, if there's a way to catch that person, if that were to 